subject. What, what is that? Some people uh, talk about it being in the uh, another movie part. You might see say, no, it's going to be what is the size of the book? Well, the, uh, a vision coming into America called the Really is not going to be a, uh, a, a movie. In the same It's not going to be in the same scene. It's really going to be a, uh, a hotel complex Opportunities for those individuals that are traveling through. Mm-hmm. Uh, so they want to be. They want to have that more business uh, atmosphere. They have to have the interaction. But they're not going to be out and all of them are not outside. No, it's not going to be done. It's not going to be done. Some people wish they would, you know, that they don't have a children's museum there. You know that? No. You have a children's museum and Jesus and. That's a good combination. Yeah, the, the Children's Museum is moving forward. Um, that's going to be an extremely uh, popular addition to the yeah. National Highway. Uh, so these are folks that now see the opportunity to uh, invest in this great economy, and they want to be there because National Highway, you know, uh, is going to win all the development. Yeah. It's going to be a destination for for many stars. Look, all of them coming through, and it's right there. You can't yeah. miss it. And, and what makes it uh, popular is the fact that, hey, look, you, you can see it. You can't say, now, how do you get there? You know, when you first come across the bridge where you're going north and south, you can That's see it. it. That's correct. <laughs> you know, there it is right there. It tells you where it is. No, it's a, it, it, it's, a, it's a great project. And, you know, we have several other projects here in town. As you know, we have some terrible issues going on. We have a lot of trouble in town. Excuse me, that's going to be a major uh, development town, uh, center type development. Uh, you know, we're going to have a different theme from that of National Highway, but it's going to be a great contributor to it. Well, 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 how do you think that, uh, uh, that what's that new road that, uh, uh, not the Delbert, the one coming from uh, Cedric? That, that, that's coming into law, right? Uh, you're talking about ICC? Yeah, ICC. Uh, that's coming from Prince George's County. Not County. From, from Laurel. From, well, it's coming from Montgomery County. County, right. right. Across into Laurel and supposed to hook up to uh, I-95. Oh, I-95. Not Route 1. Not I-95. That's where it, it's going to stop at this point in time. Mm-hmm. Eventually, they may not eventually be developed at Route 1, but at this point in time, they're going to stop at uh, so, so that will allow folks to get from Montgomery County to 95 to get to uh, uh, the area. Well, let's break that uh, bottle up on the belt. Right? Right. 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 The northern part of the bridge. Right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. Well, well, tell us about uh, the, uh, the future for Prince George County. Some of the things that you envision we could be doing. Well, I think that, you know, for us here in the county, uh, uh, we have to begin to figure out how to expand our revenue base. As you know, we had a real difficult budget uh, session this year uh, because of the downturn in the market. We're going to have to begin to encourage uh, people that to come out there, particularly business people, to come out there. And so we're going to have to begin to work at it. Uh, we have to also uh, begin to work with our schools. You know, one of the interesting things uh, that we have not talked about, and I think we need to be able to share with folks the accomplishments that we have in our schools. Uh, five of our high schools have been uh, uh, identified as uh, five of the top high schools in the nation. Five of the top high schools in the nation. What's the name of the school? They were Baby Bell Engineering, mm-hmm. uh, uh, Flowers, uh, it was Largo, uh, Oxen Hill, uh, uh, there was one other school, and I can't remember. But we need to that emphasize that. Put emphasis on that. Yeah. Well, well you, you're talking about putting money in high 
system today. When you say, when you say, uh, let's put some money into the system, improve the the uh, physical facilities. Right. Right. It's that's that's the way you you like to see Gordon Spence doing his thing. Right. Well, we spent a lot of money, and most folks don't realize it on the streets for a change. Mm-hmm. And we have basically somewhere around a two point seven billion dollar budget. Okay. Of that, about one point five or one point six goes to the streets. What about health care? Uh, health care, we're still working very hard to uh, bring closure to the problem that we've been having with our uh, system in Chattanooga and the other systems. Mm-hmm. As you know, we have uh, established an agreement with the state that we would uh, create a hospital authority and look at uh, bringing in a provider that would buy all of our system stuff and put it here in the county. The county put up uh, $24 million over two years, and the state put up $24 million over the same period of time. We have a... What about that stimulus money? You getting any of that? Well, <laughs> we're, trying to, we're trying to get some of it. Uh, <laughs> so far, we have not been successful. When the person is here with the authority of the state of Alabama, they put it lovely. Mm-hmm. He used to be the chief administrative officer on the... Uh, so we're trying to move this process forward uh, and hopefully by the fall of this year we will have had someone uh, who will not take over the system and change the house <laughs> process around. Okay, that sounds good. Mm-hmm. It's great to have you on the show. You know, I know you got some aspirations for it. As far as the government is concerned, and uh, we wish you a lot of luck in that. And you bring some very good ideas, you know, about uh, the things that come to your view. And that you, you will be working towards uh, making sure we get that money and other tools that are in the education. Uh, once again, it's great to have you on the show here. And uh, it was nice seeing you at that stadium seven here at first day, too. That was very nice. Very nice and, and, and you had your wife with you. What, what's your wife? You got to tell me her name. My wife is Donna. Donna Dean. Yeah. Donna Dean. And she's with me all the time. All the time. <laughs> <laughs> okay, once again, Donna. this is Jed Brown. And I'm Phoenix Hall.